It's Abdali here, back again with another exciting episode of Kirby Star Allies. In this video, we're going to show you guys this undiscovered trick where you can discover even more secret music within the game now that we have the version 2.0 update in Kirby Star Allies. So, if you guys didn't already update your game, do so simply by clicking onto the game from your Nintendo Switch uh, home console and then it'll automatically update. You're all set to that. Now, in the 2.0 update, we've got access to brand new characters such as Rick Kainiku, Marks, and of course, uh, your boy Gooey. But with this particular trick, you need a 100% save file, all right? So if you guys have not seen my walk through the game, I show you exactly where every single rainbow puzzle piece is, I show you where all the big switches are, and I show you all the different modes and how to get the requirements for that. So with this one, I'm telling you, 100% save file. That's exactly what you're gonna need. Now, I was just messing around in the game and I stumbled across this, so I don't think that anyone's covered this yet. I'm actually pretty pumped up to share it with you guys. And of course, I want you guys to share this too so we get a lot of people around uh, on board with sharing it as well. So let's jump into story mode. Now this is going to be very particular in what you have to do. So for starters, we're going to have to go over to the, uh, the Dream Palace and we're going to have to get one character. And once we get that one character, we'll be able to unlock this hidden music which is great. Now, in the world of Kirby, everyone loves Kirby music, right? I'm pretty sure a lot of you guys can say, oh yeah, my favorite tune is, you know, so-and-so's theme from this Kirby game, or so-and-so's theme from that Kirby game. So there's a lot of good music in the game, and I'm really pumped up to show you this one. All right, so here we go. We're in the Dream Palace. In case you guys have not seen what the Dream Palace is, uh, we need one character, and that's Rick Kine and Koo. We're gonna grab him right over here. So, these guys are accessible via, uh, not necessarily, well, I guess it is DLC, sure. Free DLC, an update, and uh, once we have Rick, we are going to be set and good to go. And that's the only character that you need. You need to make sure that you have Kirby and Rick when you're going to do this. So, here we go. We're going to jump into stage list. If you've beaten the game 100%, you guys have this extra planet right over here. And with this extra planet, we are going to have to play through it exactly. All right. So, the prerequisites, again, in order to get the secret music is having Rick Kine and Koo from the Dream Palace, Kirby, and Kirby has to have no ability, and then of course that's it, and you have to have this extra planet unlocked. And you get this planet unlocked by beating the game normally, but we need to enter it at 100%. So, here we go. Now, the reason why I like doing these kinds of videos is because Hal... Uh, the developers of this game, they like to hide secret things in the game. Uh, if you guys have not seen my video do uh, showcasing all the HAL rooms, uh, go check that out. What they do is they uh, take a hidden room inside the game and they hide it really, really well. And uh, once you find it, there's going to be some pretty cool power-ups within. So, ladies and gentlemen, we're going to have to go through and play this entire stage. And if, we, if you guys have seen me play this stage before, I'm sure you've seen some of this, but... There's gonna be a little secret thing that you get if you do the unlock requirements of having Rick and a 100% save file. So, anyway, here we are. <clears throat> so Rick's cool. Uh, Rick's a fun dude. Uh, like I said, we don't need any powers for Kirby. So we need to do this exactly like I'm doing here. So I hope you guys grab your game and play along with. You feel free to pause the video and uh, go from there. Okay, so playing Kirby Star Allies without an ability is a different experience. I truly haven't messed around with it much. I really want to go into Soul Melter with uh, with no ability Kirby and just solo it. I think it's going to be really fun. So I might try that a little bit later. Let me know in the comments if you guys want it. And feel free to answer our comment question of the day, which is uh, which of the Kirby Star Ally secrets uh, are your favorite? Alrighty. So I think there's going to be a part in this level where we are going to be forced to get some sort of power. But as soon as we get that power, we got to spit it out once we're done with that section. So don't you guys worry about it. Oh, oh. There we go. Alright, so we're going to pop that open for Rick right over that way. Okay, Rick, uh, yeah, Rick's going to do some work. Getting his buddy Koo. Oh, we got this guy, I can't really inhale him. And I can't, like, super inhale him either. So Rick kind of who's actually getting rocked right now, so I better give him a kiss. Hey, where are you going? Get over here! Oh my gosh, I need Rick. Hold on, I need Rick. I can't let him die, so he has to be part of this. And I think I already digested the melon. I don't think I'd give him a kiss. Alright, well... 
Rick's like, come on, I could have taken care of that guy for you. Okay, uh, well, Kawasaki, I don't know how I'm gonna do this one. Oh! Cooking me! Okay, yeah, this is this guy these guys are actually pretty hard when you don't have um Oh You Burn him! Burn him boy! Throw your things at him! Come here! Ow! Ow! Yo, I need him! I need him! It's okay if he dies as long as, as you have him with you. No! <laughs> Leave him alone! Dude, Kawasaki is owning us right now. You know, truth be told, I've never battled Kawasaki without an ability. So that was actually really tough. Oh my gosh, I'm sorry, Rick. I'm really sorry. Okay, here. I got some dumplings or something that I could share. Share it via kiss. You have a uh, dumpling, bruh. Here we go. Okay, so we are gonna do a little bit more work. Uh, there's a little bit more of a jog that we have to make ahead over here. Okay. Okay, so we need four people. So I'm not gonna get a power, but we have to make friends. So we're gonna take two burning Leos, just in order to get inside the door. And then once we're inside the door, then, and only then, will we be able to finish this area up. But ultimately, what you have to do is you have to have the two characters uh, by the end of this level. I don't know how I'm gonna get past this guy. Okay, that's crazy. Oh, he's coming after me. All right, well, I'm, I'm ability-less Kirby here, so I think the only way I can get over to him is if I go this way. Oh, invincibility frames. I'm out of here, dude. I'm sorry. I just have no way to beat him up. I don't know if I could like downslide into him or what, but uh, yeah, I'm, I'm so oh, thanks for the kisses, guys. Thank you. I knew that. Okay. Okay, climbing up over here. Don't need yo yo. Don't need you, I don't need Burning Leo, but we still need the four people in order to get through this door. So that's why we're keeping them. <clears throat> Alright, so this part's relatively easy. We can get a whole bunch of lives over here, but I mean, we got 217 lives. I don't really think we need that for anything. Got this? Hit it, and hit it, and then we quit it. You guys can go get the lives or whatever, it doesn't matter. Don't need them. Mm. Okay. So, we're almost there. Okay, we don't definitely don't need to do that. Oh, dude. My favorite ability just rocked me in the eye. Alright, so, yeah, you guys can do some work. Alright, here, you know what? Okay, I thought I could dodge while being on top of one of them. Okay, good. We got him out of the way. Ow. Oh! Burn him! Oh, you can dodge while you're on top of him. Great. Good job. Alright, way to go, team. Okay. 
pretty decent. And like I said, I mean, if you uh, if you're not so great at combating with Kirby by inhaling the stars that the enemies bring off, then you could easily jump on top of one of your teammates and press the down on the on the uh, control stick. And once you do that, then you'll have the ability to use whatever abilities that they have. So it's kind of like a way around it. So here we go. All right, so here we go. What we need to do is um, bring this on board. All right, this is relatively easy. Just fly through it. You're fine. Okay, we definitely don't need bonkers. And I don't want to touch Bonkers because I might get his power up. Oh, Bugsy, come on, dude. Get him out of here and don't touch his power either. Or get all that stuff. You don't need it. Paint, that's okay, she's done in two seconds. We'll hit her on the way down. And then we'll move on. I'll take the maximum tomato. Alright, deal. Alright, we're almost there, guys. Almost there. Okay, we are just gonna fly over this way. Nothing to worry about with those little DDD things. Ooh, almost got that power from uh, Poppy Bros. Alright, so we gotta do some work against Yiggy Woods here. Okay. All right, so here we are. Now, uh, let's see, we need to get rid of our teammates. Uh, if you don't know how to get rid of your teammates, you press LR, and then you press Y, and you get rid of everyone besides Rick, okay? You with me so far? Good. Now, in case you guys have not seen, this is actually the very first level in the very first Kirby game, and they recreated it, like, to a T. It's really well done. Um, all the way up until, um, you know, the very end, where Kirby takes a warp star and pretty much leaves the area. So, what we need to do right now is we've got Rick, we've got Kirby, we're all set. Get to the point where you're at the warp star from the original game, which is going to be right about here. Yes, right here. Okay, perfect, perfect. Alright, so in the original game, Kirby grabs a warp star and then he warps all the way into the back. Right here, what we're going to need to do is we're going to have to jump on top of Rick, and in case you guys didn't know, uh, you can jump on top of him, and then once you do that, uh, you can control him, which is awesome. And you're going to need to do a, a dash attack, and you're supposed to uh, hold the B button while you do it. Which is great, but you can't, you can't jump with it. So face this way, and then do the dash attack while holding B. And you're going to be on top of Rick, and you're going to be uh, just rolling down here, which is great. So that's exactly what we want to do. And jump up here, and we're going to do the exact same thing. Dash and press B while holding B, and we're going to be rolling this way. Okay, so that's the requirement. Now, pay attention, and we're going to cut to where this zooms in. I'm going to zoom into this, so you guys can actually hear what the HD rumble is doing. And that's exactly what we want.
Well, there you go. Ladies and gentlemen, we saw the hidden music within the game if you have 100% save file. What'd you guys think? Did you guys recognize the tune? I hope you guys did, because I love that music. It's my favorite music. I sing to it all the time. So, there we go, ladies and gentlemen. Secret area, of course, secret music, and only if you have the 100% save file and you went in there with Nobility Kirby and Rick. Pretty cool, right? I know. I know it was. So, there we have it. Thank you guys so much for watching. We will see you guys on the next uh, Kirby Star Allies video. It was a great time. Um, the HD Rumble feature is just amazing. I love listening to that all the time. I love the... Uh, <laughs> this whole video is just amazing. So, you guys are great. If you guys enjoy this video, make sure that you guys smash that like button, okay? And here, above all else, share this video, okay? You got one day to share it, if you know what I mean. Anyway, watch our playlist over here for the 100% walkthrough of Kirby Star Allies. Newest video on our channel right that way. Recommendations there. And don't forget to hit that subscribe button so you're updated on the latest and greatest Kirby Star Allies and Nintendo Switch content. Make sure you also turn on your notifications, and we'll see you on the next one. Thanks for watching.